Hello everybody, this is the Balloon Bandit of Amusement with a Twist. Uh, we're making simple balloon designs, quick, easy for beginners. Um, you will need two uh, balloons. These are Qualitex 260s. One is lime green and one is chocolate brown. Um, we're going to be making a balloon saber or lightsaber, whatever you want to call it. And we'll need two balloons to do this. Okay. Uh, you will want your balloon pump. This is, uh, got, I got this one at Kmart. Uh, about two three dollars. It's a dual inflator. It means it blows in one direction and blows in the other direction uh, You'll want your scissors if you can't break the balloons off by hand um, So we're gonna get started um, with the uh, um, lightsaber um, What I do is I blow up the balloon and I ask the child that I'm gonna be giving it to uh, To stick his arm out so I can tell how long the balloon is gonna be uh, because with this one it uh, doesn't matter how much off the end it is because you're not going to use the whole balloon. Uh, basically what I do is, is I make sure that it's semi-tight. I don't squish it down. And then I lay it against the child's arm to figure out how long the, the blade itself is going to be. Then I would turn, uh, make my bubble, and then I would break all this off. So if, if you're not able to do it with... Uh, um, with your um, break it off with your hands basically what you want to do is you want to hold on to your bubble here and cut it above your fingers and yeah that can get very uh, um, time consuming if you do it that way um, at parties and stuff is that you end up having to chase balloons everywhere I, that's one reason that I don't do it that way okay so you would have what looks like this if you wanted you could have uh, um, blown it all the way up to the other end and done it from the other end and that would have uh, removed the nozzle of the balloon okay so that's really up to you um, it takes about the exact same time to do it on that end or on this end it really up to you okay so next what we need to do is we need to blow up our other balloon and your colors will change and we're just gonna stick it over the nozzle of our pump uh, make sure not to crimp your balloon on the nozzle because uh, what happens sometimes is you'll have a spur or something on it and it will pop the balloon while you're trying to inflate it. So always check your pump to make sure there's nothing wrong with the end of your nozzle. Uh, also check your balloons before trying to blow them up. Nothing worse than having it pop in your face or in the face of a child while you're trying to blow it up. Okay, so now we're going to hold our uh, balloon to our nozzle. And we're just going to inflate it. And this one doesn't have to be blown up all that much either. Um, we're only going to make a few twists in it. So basically what we want to do is we want to tie our knot. As you can see I have tons of extra balloons. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start out with what is a small bubble. Followed by a small bubble. And then I'm going to uh, turn that second one into an ear twist. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this first one and I'm going to take this nozzle and I'm going to fold that that bubble in half so that I can bring it back and around and roll it into there, which in, in turn becomes an ear twist also, okay? So next what I want to do is I want to take a hand-sized bubble followed by a small bubble and now we're going to fold it over, we're squishing them together and making an ear twist by pulling out on the balloon uh, you will have less uh, friction on your balloon and now we want to net one right next to it and we're just going to pull out on it while pushing in on it and that creates that and voila okay and now you would just break off the extra part of your balloon if you have to use your scissors and see you can let it go and it, it's not going to uh, um, hurt you in any way shape or form uh, what you can do is you can have two of these and make one come out either end of your uh, uh, saber if that's what you want some people like those dual saber ones some people like that new triple saber thing where it comes out the size so you'd have one coming out this side one coming out this side and then one going out the top and then your one coming out the other end you know it really up to you um, Star Wars is releasing their new video. I can't wait to see it. But there is your lightsaber. 
if for some reason this is a little flexible, uh, what you do is you just wrap it around that ear twist a few times. <clears throat> and that will tighten this balloon and make it really hard so that it won't, like, uh, um, flex back and forth, okay? And again, we're doing simple, easy balloons for beginners. Uh, these are multiple balloons. That means it's one color plus another color or using where you had to break off and start with a new balloon. Okay, so this is a really simple, easy lightsaber balloon for beginners. Have a great one. Enjoy. This has been the Balloon Bandit Amusement with a Twist.